But many concerts last year got canceled or postponed, of course, by the pandemic. A lot of folks bummed about that. Yeah, and a lot of folks that have a stack of concert tickets from last year like like me, and that can impact whether or not you get a refund. Daybreak's Lauren Hall is in the newsroom with more on what you need to know if you're still holding on to those tickets. Good morning, Lauren. Hey, good morning, Pete. Good morning, Heather. This is another reminder about the importance of reading all the fine print when you purchase something like a ticket. We looked into the policy spelled out on the website for Vivid Seats. It says that all of its sales are final, and if an event is postponed or rescheduled, it won't qualify for a refund. The problem, of course, comes up for the customer when something gets postponed over and over again. There's no time limit on what that postponement would be. At least I've never seen one in, in terms and conditions that, that we've looked at. Vivid. And we want to know your thoughts about all of this, of course. We want to know what shows you have tickets for from last year that you're still holding out for. And if you've been able to get a refund for a postponed, not a canceled show, and what worked for you if you were, you can leave us a Facebook comment, tweet us, or text us at 716-849-2200. Lots of tweets so far this morning. Matt says he's still holding out. He has master's tickets from last year. Only a limited number of fans were allowed for this year, but he's hoping that he can go next year. Joe says he's still holding out for Billy Joel at the stadium. Lots of people with him there too. And then Mrs. Timber says she can't wait to see the BPO orchestra in person again. The streaming concerts are nice, but there's just nothing like hearing them at Klein Hand. So we'll be interacting with you all morning about these comments. You can leave them for us, Facebook, Twitter, or text at 716-849-2200. Yeah, and but Lauren, before you head out, is there any advice, any tips for those people who are trying to get ticket refunds? Yeah, actually, Vivid Seats says it looks at refunds on a case-by-case -case basis, and they've already refunded thousands of orders since the pandemic shutdown events last year. Their best advice is to send strongly worded emails, be loud about it, and demand that refund. Hopefully it works again. Let us know if it's worked for you. Yeah, certainly yeah. never hurts to ask, right? I, I like that. A strongly worded <laughs> yes. email. And be loud. We've guys. all gotten a few of those, I think, <laughs> right? <laughs> yes, indeed. All right, thanks for